the last, the last one, the last time we did, we went to a full de la Hiva, right? So we went all the way up there, and then I hooked the knee. So right. So today we're gonna work in a situation here. Let's see. I try go there, and you see he's already grabbing my pants in here. So let's see. That's gonna prevent me for pushing my leg all the way up there, right? So I'm gonna keep my de la Hiva here for now. So what I'm gonna do today in this position, very simple finish. I'm gonna need this collar grip to help me come up. So because he's grabbing my pants and not letting me go to the other side and I don't have the sleeve to do the first sweep that we work on, I'm gonna bring my foot to his hip here, okay? So in that pants grip, it's not gonna block me for doing this. Now I'm gonna start extending this leg and I'm gonna hook behind the knee, okay? Now I'm just gonna push and pull behind the knee as I turn him a little. Now my leg on the hip's gonna come back and I'm gonna use this to pull myself up, make sure this knee stays up here. And now my knee's in the middle, right? My knee's in the middle, I can start pressuring his belly, step over, and then we have that knee cut that we did have my De La Hiva, collar grip and pants grip. Step on the hip, angle myself, hook the leg. Push and pull with the hook. And I'm gonna use the momentum and the collar to drag, pull myself on top. My leg come back, I pull myself up. My knees start pressing to his belly here. I'm gonna step over and knee cut, finish on the side. Okay, 